everyone, done video stuff, Phone Gamers. We're back in the video after it feels like a millennium has gone by. Uh, we're back in the video. And uh, I hope this number works. Let's hope. Ah, <clears throat> Hello? Thank you for calling online support. How may I help you today? I must mention my computer. What happened, sir? Well, yesterday I was on the computer and I was going online looking around for stuff and I got a nasty pop up saying that there was something wrong with my computer. My computer crashed, it shut off, and then I turned it back on this morning, but the pop up was gone. But it's, I think there might be a virus okay. or something left behind from it or something, I'm not exactly sure. Okay, so sir, sir, I just uh, copied your number. My other technicians will call you back in next two minutes. Okay, they'll help you with your problem. Okay. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. Hi. Uh, hi sir, my name is Mark from Online Technical Department. I just missed a call from you, so I call you back. Is there any problem over the computer or on your laptop? Well, I was explaining to the guy that yesterday <clears throat> I got uh -huh. a nasty pop-up. It was saying that there was a virus on my computer, that there was something wrong, and then all of a sudden my computer just crashed. It just died right in front of me. So I turned it back on this morning, and the pop-up was gone, but I think there might be a nasty mm -hmm. virus left behind or some sort of worm because some, some things just don't seem to be acting right on the computer. So I'm just kind of leery about what's going on, I guess. Yeah, because, you know, that the virus totally out from you. But, you know, the problem which you have is not out from the computer. It will come back again because that the problem under the network came through. So, so we have to see it and I will fix it properly. So it will not come back again and you will not face problem in this anymore, right? Uh, so it's a network problem? Yeah, it will be the virus which you have, so it came through the network. So I have to check it, like why it came and why it is infecting you here. Okay. So are you at the computer? I can check it out for you. Yeah, I'm at the computer right now. Okay, and, and can you do one thing? Can you press Windows key and R as in drop it at the same time? R as in Romeo, yep. <coughs> Yep. And what do you see after it? Uh, I pressed it and it says run and then it says type the name of a program, folder, document, or net resource and Windows will open it for you. Alright, and below that you see a box where you can just type something? Yeah, it says open. And then a uh, box, yeah. There's something blinking in it. Alright, make sure, make sure your box is empty. Okay. Alright. Okay, is that empty? Yeah, like my soul. Okay. Okay, so you can do one thing. You type in that H is in hotel. Looks hotel, okay. H is in hotel again. Looks hotel. On space. Okay. Looks hotel. And then type H is in hotel again. It's Hooks Hotel, but okay, um, H H space H. Right. Okay, uh, I clicked OK, now it says HTML help display, this page cannot be displayed. Okay, and near to that you see a yellow color tiny question mark along with that? Yeah, I see that. Okay, and... Okay, and click on the question mark once. Uh, I see... Okay, I did that. It says file about help uh, jump to URL and exit. Okay, and click on jump to URL. Okay. Okay, and, and what do you see then? Uh, it wants a URL. It says a file path and then URL. Okay, type in that www dot. Okay. C is in Charles, B is in Brian. Okay. T is in Tom, T is in Tom. Okay. 
Odd as in Robert. Okay. How is Romeo? Dot com. Okay. C B T T R. Right. Okay. And hit okay after that. Alright. Um something's opening here. Okay, it says establish support connection. Right, and now you just uh, type it, uh, is that you type the support key, a secured support key for the computer I am providing to you. Okay. Just hold on for a quick moment, okay? Alright. Hold on. Alright. Give me a quick second, should it's very slow, you know? Should, yeah. Uh -huh. don't get to me to it. Yeah, should I type my name? No, it's not required your name on it. I just provide you a secure support key for the computer. Hold on for a moment. It says establish support connection. Type your name and support key. Receive from the technician. Click continue to proceed. Mm. Uh, no, it's not required your name anymore. You just type your support key because the name we have already related to the name because you are the user of the Microsoft. So since you are the user of the Microsoft, you registered you with that and it says A L T O O N A L Tuna. Who's that? What is that? So are you Microsoft then? No, we are online certified technician through Microsoft. Microsoft is a company and all the technician who is certified through there, they call Microsoft Certified Technician, that's we are. So we have a registration with you already, and your name is Altuna, right? Uh, what is that? A-L-T-O-O-N-A. -O -O uh, yeah, my name is definitely Altuna. Okay, no problem, you just type the support key on the computer, I'm providing to you. Hold on, give me a moment. Okay. Is okay, just sir, I'm doing that. I'm just uh, giving you a secure support key for the computer. Just wait for a while. Hold on for a moment. Okay, hold on. Okay, here we go. This is coming out within a few seconds on that. And the support key, I'm giving it to you. Must be using like Windows 2000 there. <clears throat> I'm sorry, you have a questions on it? Uh, just, I don't know. We gotta turn up to the 56k modem. We gotta, we gotta, uh, what it's worth it. Kind of, we gotta overclock it to 57k. <laughs> Get that fast dial up going there. Okay, so you just type the support key over the computer, which I have 877. Okay, just a second. Take your time. Okay, yep, 877. 780. 780. Uh, 984. 984, okay. And then click on continue. Alright. Button. Did Button. that? Okay, uh, okay. Uh, okay, it's opening. Once it open, you tell me what that what did you show you after that? Oh, hold on a second, sir. And where you are located? You sounds like Californian. Are you in California? Hello. Are you there? You with me? Hello? Okay, so, uh, okay, so thank you. Right now we successfully connected with the computer. Thank you so <coughs> much for that. Okay. Had, so right uh, now I can see. Uh -huh. What were you asking me before? 
I'm sorry. No, no, no. Don't click here and there. You are with me right now. US I am successfully from California, with you. right? Uh, I'm Massachusetts, but not California. No, you asked if I was from California. You, uh, I am? No. Uh, I sound no. like California. No, if I was in California, huh? you asked if I was in California. Uh, uh, I, you know, I just guess your accent because I just receiving the call from California from last three three years. But that's why I have knowledge about the wow. accent. You did a good job. Yeah, I'm, so, I'm definitely from California. All right, sir. Because, you know, I'm still here from so long, and I just get the accent through there, right, that's yeah. why I told you. I, I get you, yeah. I can understand that. Okay. So right now I go ahead, I'm going to check the problem out, what kind of problem going on, and why I, you I, face this you issue. Know, I, I, I've got the accent so down, I know for you from India, but, you know, you know, Massachusetts is great, too. Yeah, Massachusetts. But originally, you know, originally I belong to India, right? Yeah. Originally, but, you know, when since I got the job here, it's from 2011 I'm living here I got the accents like that and learn something and totally speaking like this right yeah you sound but, like every other but I, was, I told this I settled here with my family but I'm thinking to go in California I want to transfer in California if I, I get a chance we have offices in Los Angeles the Los Angeles will be where I can go after this uh, this journey yeah the do one thing <laughs> so I will be there I will be gotta... happy and very bad yep yep Yep, you gotta do the, the do one thing, the each but, and everything. It, but, that's, that's how you gotta live. Okay, so here it goes. I'm checking out what kind of problem you have and why you're facing this problem. Okay. So first of all, in order to see, I'm running a scan on the computer. And after the scan, we will get okay. to know what went wrong and why the computer operating system having this critical warning on it. Let me do that for you. And I show, it shows you your name is Richard, right? Is it is it your name, Richard? Uh, Yeah. It's actually no, it's Altoona. You can see here the scan is going going on. Mm -hmm. Your file, folder, document totally information. Right now, but yep. It's not scanning going on through there. I have to start over again. I know. You can't type too slow. slow. Time. Yeah, you got to type a little faster, then it'll go a little quicker. Okay. Give me a moment. Are you the owner of this computer, sir? Yep. Here, uh, hold on a second. Can I can I help you real quick? Uh huh. Just a second. Um, and the scan's broken. Here, let me show you something. I'll show you something real quick. If you do this, actually, I think it's how oh, I'm. It's been a long, long time since I've done this. If you do that, it'll run a little bit longer. That way, you can type a little faster. There you go. It's a little, it's a little fast. See, you just weren't see. Now you gotta do it again. Now, now go ahead, type. I do that. Hold on. Oh, okay. And I have my senior technician who will be helping me with that. Hold on for a moment. He wants this call to take in, right? Hold on. Okay. Right? Okay. Give me a moment. All right. Hold on for a second. You speed up your typing a little bit. <laughs> this guy's a complete moron. He's probably going, he knows a better scan than we do. What will we ever do here? Now I'm transferring the call to my supervisor here. Hold on. Okay. All right. Okay. Getting how to shoot you. <clears throat> yeah. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? Hi. Yeah. I'm not sure why I transferred to you, but um, I I guess I'm not sure. He was trying to do a scan or something. <laughs> Oh, we are not scamming you, sir. No, no, not a scam, a scan. A scan? Oh, oh, oh yeah. S -C -A -N. We are just uh, running a scan, yeah. So, you're a computer person, you know how to use computers, right? No. 
Uh, okay. And who's Richard? That would be me. Okay, so your name is Richard, right? Yep. Okay. Okay, so I think like uh, everything is fine in your computer. Nothing is required. Like oh, really? it's been working fine. Really? According to me, your computer's been totally fine. Yeah. Okay, then explain to me this. Why, so, why did your uh, your fake technician type that stupid Zeus thing in there? Then you know I can hear him typing. Who? You know how pathetic you think people are. <laughs> I mean, how stupid do you think people uh, sir, are? I don't know, sir. I I told you that. Your computer is good to go, like it's been working fine. I can yeah, see that. Yeah, I, I know it's good to go, but then why did your technician lie and go to CMD, do the tree command, and then type a fake little message saying that there's the Zeus virus on here? I mean, really. <laughs> okay. And not only that, he, he was typed just trying slowly. to do like, something you can, in your computer. Okay, look, I'll even demonstrate what he did. Here, let me show you this. Okay. Right now, <clears throat> oh, everybody's mm -hmm. watching the viewing audience here. Right now, I'm recording you, <laughs> and I recorded what your technician did. I want to show you this. Okay, so let me let me just transfer this call to him. Okay. No, talk no, 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 no. I okay. want to talk to you. I want to talk to you. You're the you're the head technician, oh. head supervisor, whatever you are, head scammer. I don't whatever. Oh. <laughs> All right, you see okay. this? You see what he was running? Yes. That's called the tree command. Should I go online and show you what the tree command means? Because I okay. guarantee you, it is not a scan. It lists directories, okay. and you so. know that. You know that it lists directories. It does not scan the computer. Right. 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 You're absolutely right, sir. Right. So, uh, it was nice talking to you. No, wait, right? wait, wait, you're not just going to hang up. I want to know why you think it's hard to scam so what, people. You think you thought you could take advantage of me, or what? Uh, let me tell you, sir, I'm not and doing then you, anything. You, you say that you computer. know my name, you thought my name was El Tuna, because, I mean, because you, th you think you uh, work with Microsoft. <laughs> if you're a Microsoft partner, partner what's your partner uh, information? I'd like to know it. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so uh, let me tell you that. No, so you're going to put these things on the website, right? Oh, I'm gonna put you on my website. Okay, you can put it. No, no worries. Uh, I'm not like. Can you show me your website so that no, it would be good for us yeah. in future if we want to get any information from that? Yeah, please put your website over here. Yeah. Here's my website. Okay, right here. stop. Oh, stop, stop phone scammers dot com. Yep. Yeah. Okay. One of my previous so how many people? Are you. Okay. So how many how many people are working with you right now? Uh, quite a bit. I've got a, a company behind me right now. Uh, actually, I just I just uh -huh. started working with another company, and I've got a few oh, partners okay. working with me, and we've exposed quite so, a bit of companies, <laughs> and we're pretty popular. Oh. Oh, that's very good. Uh, yeah, I can see that you are very popular. And what is this? Uh, Twenty-five dollars. What is this been? This is a legitimate tech for? support site that somebody's uh, advertising in my site because there's so many scammers out there that no one else would go to. People like you okay. that lie to people. So I would like to. Uh, let me ask you one thing. If yeah. people, if somebody is having any problem in their computer, so which which security you will provide them? I don't do tech support. But if somebody's having a problem with that computer, okay. that I would actually help them out based on what they were asking. If they were asking for help with their okay. antivirus, so they need you, a recommendation for the antivirus, I'd install Komodo on there. I wouldn't go to the tree command and lie and saying there's some error wrong with the computer and there really isn't. Sir, let me tell you, there are, there are different things, right? Uh, I don't know what he was telling you. So he just what transferred mean, this call to me so that I can listen you. to you. You're you. the head supervisor. You're supposed to know exactly what your technicians... I mean, you have recorded lines, I'm guessing. You could listen in on the call. I mean, I don't... Yeah. I mean, most of you guys have script, you scammer. Most of you scammers have script, and I know because I've gotten some of them. Okay. So, uh, you know each and everything, so, like, uh, this thing has been... Yeah, I know each and everything. <laughs> ...going pretty good. So, uh, you're you know, getting okay, can so I tell many you, calls. Can I tell you me. something? You say yes. each and everything so much that there is a scam baiting channel called each and everything. That's because you guys say that so much. I don't understand why you say that so much. Okay, so you're getting money, uh, like uh, how ma how much money you've been generating from this thing? That's none of your business. How much money like, I you might be getting? Okay, that's. See, here's okay, my no uh, problem. here's my YouTube channel. Yeah, the website. I yeah, just hit two thousand uh, subscribers last week. You know. Okay. YouTube, yeah. Okay. And I see, you know, this video's got eleven thousand views. 
You know, I mean, I, I thirteen thousand. So, I mean, you know. So you you are the you are the owner of this com company, right? Yep. The okay. And so you are the leader, right? Yep, that's me. Okay. So what was your name? Uh, my name is Richard, or Altoona, whatever one you or want Richard, to use. Okay. Apparently, you know my <laughs> okay, name. Okay. So. Okay. Okay. No. I was just asking you that. Whether, what's your name? <laughs> okay. So all uh, these can I, can I ask and you else real quick too? You said you're yeah. located in. Uh, your other guy said you're located in Massachusetts. Am I right? Right. Okay. Uh, you mind telling me what the weather's like there right now? Weather? Yeah, what the weather is right now. You should just be able to look outside and tell me what it is. You know. Okay, I will look out. Yeah, let me just see how the weather over there. I'm in my office right now, so. No, you should be able to listen. Oh, hey. look out, look out the window yes. and tell me what the weather is. I'm just, I'm, I'm telling to my technique, uh, my one of my assistant. He's just seeing how's the weather over there. Mm -hmm. Over there, cause you know. How's the weather? There. Okay, yeah, pretty good, pretty good weather. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty good. The weather. weather is quite good. What is it? Is it sunny? Yeah. Is it cloudy? Not, is it rainy? Too. Or what was it? Is it what? Tell me what it is. Uh, it's very nice. It, sunny. It? It's been sunny over here. Rainy, sunny. Yes. <laughs> oh, you're. It's been sunny. Yeah. Oh, you're you're actually wrong. Okay. It's rainy. <laughs> Can, so okay. so do you know do you know what the temperature is? Temperature, yes, temperature is quite good. You gotta, you gotta look it up on Google. Sorry? You gotta look it up on Google because you don't know. No, sir, I don't want to Google. Well, if you're in Boston, you should be able to tell me what the, the temperature is. Uh, I would like to ask you one thing. Like, uh, Does it mean anything like uh, on these questions, you put some questions to me and yeah, Well, I'll Yeah, it answer. does mean something because uh, you're lying. Right, I know you're wrong. not in Boston. You're sitting in New Delhi right now. You're not in Boston. Okay. You're you're nowhere near oh. Boston. Really? Yeah. Oh, really, really? Really? I've talked to enough of you okay. people to know so exactly. I think every single one I've ever talked to has been so in New Delhi. Please. So you want to come here? No, I don't want to go to New Delhi. Okay. So what you would like to do now? I just want to know why you want to, why you're scamming people. I just want to know. So you keep on uh, putting these websites and these um, videos on website on your website, okay? And yeah. earn some money. Oh, I'm and not doing earn good money. money. I'm not doing it for money. Thing. I'm doing it for awareness. I could care less about the money. Awareness, okay. Yeah, and it's, it's been working okay. pretty well. I mean, one of my partners actually helped getting a company shut down. So that was pretty cool on uh, our part. So that was really neat. Oh. One of my that's previous good. partners have actually exposed yeah, it before. Day. You know, you know, every day a new company is being co coming and with the new And you know what, every day a new, new scam record, bait channel is being created and a new scam yeah. bait video is being made. So, you know, the more, you know, you, the so more this, video this scam war, bait videos that they're out there, the harder and harder it's going to be for you guys to scam people. Because the more awareness that's spread, the harder it will be, you know, for you to scam people. It's up to us, sir. You know, we, I mean, people why, why need can't you people get need a normal people security job, you know, like, for their computer. Like, why don't you actually open a legitimate tech support business? Because... I have yet to find any legitimate tech support so, businesses on the line right so now. Every single do you one think, I've ever uh, to in, in the UK, in the US, uh, what about Geek Squad? They're providing the services? Yeah, but they're legitimate tech support. That's why they're still in business. And that, you know, they're legitimate tech support. <clears throat> okay, so you are in favor of that, right? I'm in favor of legitimate tech support. I, I have no favorite tech support company. Okay. Okay, I totally understand your thing, each and everything you told me. That's very good. Okay, so right now, so so everything, yeah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the video that's still recording. I'm gonna upload it, and everything that I have, I'm gonna post publicly, and I'll pass it along uh, to the proper authorities. Yeah, please, please do it. Yeah, no problem. I, mean, I don't have any problem. Okay, I mean, I know do whatever I, you want to do. I've seen quite a bit right now in the. Uh, and the news about Indian police starting to crack down these fake IRS scam call centers and these fake tech support scam call centers. And, you know, these people when they're arrested, they, they walk away with their, you know, hands covering their eyes because, you know, they just can't <laughs> can't have the public show even though they scammed. It took a bunch of people most money. They just too cowardly show their face, so. Yeah, this has been happening over here, so, yeah. you know, everybody is doing, everybody's doing, they're working for money, right? 
And also, uh, by I the way, you your, your, your uh, for money, phone right? number is posted in the Discord you... with uh, around 4,000 members, so you're going to get prank calls quite a bit, just so you know. Yeah, it's it's okay. It's quite obvious over here we are getting calls. Yeah, well, no problem. it's probably a good thing. That way, uh, you know, we're wasting we're all guys' time, so you guys can't scam people. There's some people that try and to call in for tech you support. So, you people and take advantage of old you, people. Me... For, specifically, you take advantage of old people. Or really computer-naive people who so you take advantage of. Okay. Let me tell you, you are also wasting your time. Right? I'm not wasting my time. Actually, my time of me doing this has been very beneficial to me. I'm very successful at it. I have not wasted any of my time. Okay. I've met some of the greatest people in the world doing this. I have not wasted okay. any of my time. All you scammers seem to say that, but okay. you know what? You're wasting your time. You're sitting at a call center right now scamming people. I'm surprised with your religion, oh, yeah. how that's even acceptable. You know, you know nothing about me, and you're saying this thing, right? <laughs> well, I know one you know thing. You're saying you're call center right now, scamming <laughs> people. Otherwise, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. I know. This is this is the only sure. thing you know about me, right? Yeah, and this is the only thing people. you know that I'm I'm a scammer, right? <laughs> and you're not in Boston, <laughs> <not> too. <laughs> oh, that's great. So just put this video on your channel, okay? I will. And let's see how many likes you will get. I'll get quite a few, don't worry. I, I've got my, uh, I don't yeah. care about likes, I care about the views it gets, so that way it spreads more awareness. And, and be in touch, okay? Okay. You can call me anytime. <laughs> oh, uh, you know, I'll what's, still the, yell what's the number? Give give me a number. It's on your caller ID. Call you. It's on your caller ID, unless you're too cheap for that. <laughs> uh, can you provide me with your number, contact number? Yeah, 814. 204-2289. And by the way, it's not pronounced El Tuna, it's pronounced Atlanta. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> uh, okay. So this is the number which I'm getting on my computer screen. It's uh, 814-204-2289, right? Yep, same number. Okay, I'll save this number and talk to you later, okay? Okay. Just consider okay. getting a new Goodbye, job. good luck. Yep, yep, okay. <laughs> okay. You want to talk to Mark, the uh, same technician, the scammer? <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm, I'm glad you think this is funny. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Sorry, who are you? Hey, Richard. Yeah. That's Mark again. Yeah. You got it? All right, so you were talking to M. Parker, and he told you, Sean Parker, about the computer and bullshit, whatever you have with you, all right? Yeah, I, you know, you're sitting there laughing like a little oh, two-year-old. That's real professional. That was not professional? No, you're not professional at all. So I want to know why you're scamming. I am. I want to know why you're scamming people. You know, why Why did you have to run that fake tree command? No, no, no. And, you know, a good tip to you, you should type a little faster, because that's so obvious when you, you can hear the typing sound, and then you're sitting there typing the messages just appearing. I mean, <laughs> duh. Uh, that, no, no, what I do, what is my job here, I just see the Scam problem, people. I'll fix it for... You didn't fix anything. <laughs> you said you said that the tree command was a scan. You didn't you didn't fix anything. I have it recorded. You know, we can show here. I can show you exactly what I'm talking about. See, I've done so many of these calls that I've started to create a database of scammers, and I've created uh, a, my my site. I've created a section for people to learn about scammers and their tactics, and I'm actually going to be updating it pretty soon. Um, we can look down here. So, you know, the same man in my department, one of they my, run the tree you know, command, we are which, technical... Listen to this, uh, listen to this. They run the tree command, which states the directories and files within the operating system. There is no way for scanning the system for infections. Did you not run the tree command? Did you not do this? Alright, so how do you know that? Because it was right in front of me, and I have it recorded. I saw you do the tree command scam. You know what? Here, look at this. I even took a screenshot of it. You took a screenshot of the same page? I took a screenshot of you running that fake scan. And you know what? I have it all on video. And right now you're connected to a virtual machine, which has nothing wrong with it. Yeah. I'm sure you know what a virtual machine is. That's the virtual machine on the computer, right? Yeah, you're connected to a virtual machine right now. Oh my, all right, no, we don't have any problem with that, you know, we are going to change our job within a few days, okay? And what I, I do, I will, I will make the same IP address, I will show you, I will take you on a YouTube, like you are a scammer. We have that kind of technology, it's 2016, right? <laughs> you, you have the tech, you know, I think you just figured out how the light bulb works in India, I don't think you have any sort of technology, I'm sorry. I have it. <laughs> 
Okay. But, uh, yeah, I'll be waiting. Uh, uh, you know, here, actually, you know what? Send me uh, your YouTube channel right here. Type in this notepad. I'll be waiting for your video. It'll just give me a bunch more views anyway. I, uh, type, type your channel name right there. I'm sorry. I'll be, I'll be waiting for the video. Type Ma your channel name. I'll be waiting for it. No, no, I wouldn't. I cannot give you any information because you are a techie guy. You have knowledge. Maybe you can hack my IP address through this. Oh, so, so all, many of, sudden, will be all of a sudden, things have turned around. Now you don't want to give me anything. <laughs> I'm totally scared with that. If you do something wrong with me, I cannot. I cannot share this bullshit to you. You know. See, you just cursed at me. See, how is that, how is that legitimate? How is, I have not cursed at you once. How is that legitimate? I've had to hold it back. Actually. I'm fatty. How, how have you not? How, how is that legitimate? You just cursed at me. You know. No what? Jesus Christ, I feel like I'm talking to a wall right now. So, what do you think, right? What are you going to do after this hang in the column? I'm going to run this video and I'm going to upload it, like I just told the other guy, but apparently I have to tell you five times before it actually sticks in your brain. Okay, and you know, I have one more technician. He's totally unaware with that. Can you talk to him? He's just thinking you will helping you getting help from him. I'll talk to the whole call center. You, so how you will get fixed the computer if you face problem? What do there you do There is with nothing it? wrong with this computer. It's a virtual machine. It was set up to scam bait scammers. And yet you claim there's something oh, wrong with it. I'm sorry. And yet you claim there's something wrong with it. I did not claim. You that told me. I didn't know that. I was thinking it out. I didn't say that you have problems. Uh, okay. You have uh, no, 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 no. Because you sat there and you typed the Zeus commit. You said the Zeus virus is on there. You sit there. And you sat there and typed that out. Mm, uh, right, right. I checked that out. You told me that some kind of virus was there. And yeah, and you I know what you did? The, you, no, you did. You took advantage of that and you did the tree command and typed the Zeus virus was found. I saw you type that out and then you're going to tell me that there was a Zeus virus on the computer. You're going to go on Google and show me the Zeus no, virus I, on I Wikipedia. Didn't type. And then you're going to make charge me some ridiculous fee that was nowhere you know that I didn't even need because there's nothing wrong with the computer in the first place you know I've been in through enough of these scams I know exactly how they go out you know I've been doing this since what March and you know this is not my first rodeo <laughs> crickets 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 so how many videos you you lined up so far on on YouTube? I think Did I have scammer thing or not? I think I have around sixty uh -huh. videos now, sixty one videos, something like that. Alright, so sustain video you put into that. So uh, what the benefit you you having with this? Like we because you know under the way that may be the way is different, but we are helping to the customer. We are providing <laughs> you the support to every customer here, right? You understand that? Oh, I love I love how you say that, but you're you're not you're lying to customers and saying there's something wrong with the computer, sitting there doing the tree command, saying it's a scam and it isn't, and then typing the Zeus virus is found or whatever the hell you type. No, no, you're not, you're not providing any support to customers at all. We just help to the customer through the way we have <laughs> No, you don't. Here. You're not providing any help to anybody. See, here, here, this is what I do. See, the feedback I get from people is probably a lot better than the feedback you get from people. You know, I get people thanking me for uploading this video because now they weren't scammed by this, you know, fake company that pretends to be tech support and they're really not. You know, I have a hotline set up for people to call when they're scammed or report a scammer. You know, I just get benefits. You know, I do get paid for doing this, but that isn't the reason why I do this. The reason why I do this is to spread awareness, which is the main reason why I've been doing this since March. And the feedback I get is much better than any size payment I could get possible. People, just the kind of remarks I get from people thanking me. And you know, and I absolutely love it when a scammer emails me to beg, they beg me to take a video down because it's affecting their scam company. And I never do. But we do not. We don't do like that. We don't care with this. We help to the people once they register with let me, us. Let me read so this to you all again. The we, <clears throat> we, don't, we don't have any, any issues if you uh, line up the video again. on so, YouTube with us. You know, so let's we have see. They'll say that uh, they run the tree command, which states that the directories and files... With, with all the, all the, they run the tree command, which just states directories and files within the operating system and has no way of scanning the system for infections. Yet you did the tree command and typed the Zeus virus and claimed that it was scanning for infections. 
Should, should we go to Malwarebytes website? Yeah, you know, you know, an actual libel source. Should, should I show it you to know, you there? Through, through, that, is, that is only the way. Everyone is helping to the customer by different, different way here because we are not the person no, who can directly know, call you know, every person. And then once you realize how smart you when I did the tree command slash f command, which all it does is just extend it and do a deeper search, you had to transfer it to your manager because you didn't know what to do because it wasn't part of your script. Which which one? That's in my part. Of, no, that is, that was not the part of the script. But you know, the people of United <laughs> States, USA. Yeah, I made this script on that. I really, I, I, yeah, I acknowledge. But what happens here? See, the thing is, is that you guys kill. are given a script, and you read from the script. And I know because I've have I have a few of these scripts. I've I've gotten somehow people have gotten hold of these and they sent them to me. They've gotten control of the cameras, computers. Can you tell me? Can you tell me how I use my script? Can you have any script on it? Uh, I've got some script on my actual computer somewhere. I have it buried, but uh, I, don't, I don't know if I have any with me. I can look real quick. Uh, so help me, Sam. I will just use it in my call. Hold on a second. Take yeah. your time. Yeah, I've got a bird in my Donald's folder someplace. I don't have it on me right now, but I've had I have scripts of these actual pop ups gamers, so I, I know you guys use scripts. And uh, you know, I want to send you a script anyway because I don't want you to, to uh use it against people. So You know, this company is running from last 25 years. It's not the new one. No, no. So we are totally... You know, that here. doesn't matter because, like I said to the other idiot, the more videos that are uploaded, the more scam bait channels that are created about these fake things you guys do, the more awareness is going to be spread. And trust me, this is starting to get big now. Uh, I just saw some in the news the other day. The FTC took down another pop-up scammer. And... I'm well aware much of how these scams work. You guys, I'm not saying your company does this in particular. I don't know if it does or not. So I didn't call you from a pop-up. But these companies create fake pop-ups, and then they have multiple companies attached to this one number, and it's sent through a ring group. And it just randomly picks company that's in the ring group. <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What do you say? Are you always... I know. It's probably too complicated for your brain. But, I mean, you know, it's mm -hmm. not... It, I just don't get it. Why Why can't you get... I mean, I understand, you know, in New Delhi right now, there's a hard time getting a job, but of all places, why would you get a, a job scamming people? I mean, I'm sure they tell you, and I'm sure you have to know when you're sitting there typing the tree command, and that and they tell you to type that fake message that, that it's a scam job that you're running. You can't not know. I'm sorry, you, uh, if I put type, type a tree command on this, and when I type in the bottom, juice by the sound, so that is not right. What? Oh my god. When you're sitting there typing the tree command, and then the script tells you to type some sort of fake message, you cannot yeah, yeah. not know that it's, a, that, that it's a scam. I mean, you have to know that it's a scam. That's I'm sure the, when they hired you, uh, they told you it was a scam. Uh, right. The scam jobs are running. No. They they didn't tell me anything about. It. They just told me that you job. You just uh, help the customer through there. If we didn't, you just select them and you register them again. They face problem. You receive the call okay, in the manner. Okay, either way, but when you're, like I said, when you're sitting there typing the tree, typing the tree command and typing out that fake virus right, message, right. you have to know it's a scam because you know that isn't a real scam when you're sitting there typing the message out yourself. And not only that, when some somebody sits there and sees you typing out the message and hears your keyboard typing, I mean that's that's just beyond pathetic. Maybe I might be not, not sure. I have to talk to my manager about it if it will be a bit scam. So I talk to them and it will be I will I'm gonna leave the job within a few days. Oh what kind of job I will get here apart from this one? I have good communication skills. Which one will be okay? Can you suggest me for that? <coughs> well you can work at Big Rock t uh, Big Rock Solutions. It's a website a hosting company based out of India. It's a great place to work. I know you're not in Massachusetts and I know you're not in the United States. You're sitting in New Delhi, India right now. And there's plenty of other jobs in India than scamming call centers. I'm at, I, I'm not. I, you know, I'm not. I'm only a 12th grade person. I'm practicing graduation. Don't have that much money to just use for any kind of medical thing and MBBS and all. So you tell me what kind of thing you have you have for me, where I can leave the job and find another way. Do tell me. You know that isn't my responsibility. Finding your job, you have to worry about you and after about me. All I'm saying is that you shouldn't be working at a tech support scam call center. 
I mean, unethically. No, no, no. I mean, uh, it should be. It should be okay. your responsibility, man. Man, you should be. You know, and you know, I already gave you a suggestion, and you just didn't listen. I say you should yeah, go yeah. work at Big Rock Solutions, because they're. Uh, oh, you should was give me a the clear. Yeah. Right. And you told me. Okay, I, I agree. I it's agree. It's not my responsibility because I'm not in your life right now. I have nothing to do with your life. I'm just saying that you shouldn't be working at a call center like this. I should not be working in a call center. Not a scamming call center. Actually, it shouldn't work in a call center period because people get irritated when they get irritated annoyance calls from people trying to sell stuff and everything. Call center is just irritating. You know, the people of United States do not, they not have that much of time to see the video and all, and they don't see that. You know? uh, no, I'd like to disagree with you. That just shows how naive and stupid you are. Okay, that video will not have 13,000 views on it if people didn't watch it. And guess what? Half of those are from the United States. Again, shows how stupid you are. That is the company, the panel department, uh, always uh, is here from so long and helping the customer through there. There is no blame on it. What you just said made absolutely no sense. You just, I can't. When you guys try to put sentences together, it drives me nuts. I can't understand half the time without you all are saying. Uh, but. And what about, can you give me one, ask me, ask you one thing if you don't mind? You don't, uh, you in United States also, or United Kingdom? I'm in the United States. USA, okay. I thought you had a good accent telling, by the way, I'm not in California. <laughs> yeah. You're not in California? No. By the way, it's pronounced Atlanta, not Altoona. All right, all right. So, right now, that's the only job you have. You find the people like this, and you line up on a YouTube. And what, what all you do about, apart from this? I hope you will be having some technical knowledge. You will be an IT guy who is professional. Well, you know, I'm much part of the computers. I'll say that much. I don't sit here and read from a script. I have actual knowledge of computers, and I know how they work. And... I build computers, I work on computers, and uh, you know, I have plenty of background. So why, why, do, why don't you do one thing? Why don't you provide don't support think. for the entire United States? Why don't you provide the support for the entire United States? So I they do. don't. Uh, why don't you provide legit it's... support for the United States? No. So why the customer face problem after having it? After your protection, why they face problem? Why they directly go to local store, waste the time, so many things, living the different different prices, paying uh, uh, everything? Why that? Why? Well, you tell just, me. I, I don't understand what you're asking. That doesn't make sense. I tell you. You told me that I provide you support to the uh, United States, computer and all, right? So why we are having more than 50,000 customers with us? Why we have? If you have everything for because them. Because people don't right? know. People don't know. They, I mean, there's online tech support that's based in the United States that is legit. People don't know. They find your scam website. Or, you know, your fake pop up and they call and they don't know what they're doing and they're naive and you people take advantage of them. If you just people would just provide legitimate tech support, maybe this half the stuff wouldn't happen. I mean, why can't you provide legitimate tech support? What you're asking is completely irrelevant to what is actually going on right now. That's completely irrelevant. That you're scamming people, is what you're doing. So. Okay, so what I do here, my job is here right now, talk to my manager, like, is that legit or not? If it will be, my promise you, I'm going to hang, I'm gonna no, hang up the it's, job. it's not legitimate. I've already proven that. The people in the video are going to prove that. It's already recorded. It's not legitimate. I've done this enough times, I know it's not legitimate. I've showed you it's not legitimate. I've showed you now three times it's not legitimate. Uh, yeah, I don't need to I'm know that it's not legitimate job. or not, I, you know. <laughs> all right. First of all, I have to clarify this thing, you know. I cannot believe on you like this. I have to just verify this thing from... Your manager is not going to tell you. He doesn't want you to quit. He's not going to tell you that's a scam. He doesn't want you to quit. He knows it's a scam. And you know what? Yeah. Take that. That's a channel link to my... That's a direct link to my YouTube channel. Let me check it out. Hold on. That way you can... You can keep a copy of it yourself so you can see when this video goes on the air. Okay, I do. If I just heard, I just re check the channel. If uh, I see something is legit in that, so what I do, I'm gonna hang. I'm just leaving the job, okay? Um, and I'm I'm gonna find find a new one, right? There will be the legit call center because I. 
Oh, good luck finding a legit one. And, okay, and if you have something like job and all, you tell me. I can in your place, United States. Why would it matter to you? You're not even in the United States. I'm sorry? You're not in the United States. Why does it matter to you? Can you tell, you, tell, me, can you tell uh, your teleprompter in the background to shut up? So you can use your own mind? Alright, let me tell you. Tell him. Hold on. Okay, so, okay, so, so you want me to put myself out from this crap, from this scam, okay? That's what you want, right? No, I just wanted to quit scamming people. I want the whole company going, that's what I want. But, you know, I guess I'll have to, that, that's not going to happen, so I guess I'll just have to upload the video, which is fine. Okay, so, so we're getting nowhere. Uh, I have enough proof that this company's a scam. Um, and, you know, I, I don't really need to sit here and talk to you anymore. I've got enough proof. I've got the proof. Everything that's been talked about is recorded. I'm still recording currently. Everything that's happened has been recorded. And the recording will not end until this call is hung up. So, thank you. And uh, I hope you find a better job. And, uh, you know, quit scamming people. All right, I do. Thank you. Not say. Be in touch, alright? I probably won't Until be in I'm touch, here. but I'm sure you'll get prank called quite a bit. Alright, have a nice day. Bye bye. Hey, wait, wait, hold on a minute. You might tell me what your real name is instead of Mark. I know it's not your real name. I'm sure you probably won't, but you know. Uh, no, that's my new real name, sir. I'm right. Christian. You can't tell me your real name? Well. No, that's my real name. No, it's not. It's probably like. It's probably like, uh. John or something like that, some like crazy Indian name. I'm sorry, what name? Some crazy Indian name. So I'm sure it's what it is. I, I doubt it's actually Mark, because it isn't. I'm sorry, that's not in my hand. I cannot provide this information to that recorded line. I really apologize <laughs> for that. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you, do you realize how stupid you are? I have your IP address now. I'm sorry. I have your IP address now. You have my IP address? Yeah, can you can you see my screen? Let me check it out, hold on. No, I cannot see. I you just stop your screen from me. Oh, okay, how do I, I, I how do I uh stop hold on, let's see, uh yeah, send me a request again to start it. You want to see that? Yeah. Can and can you tell me uh, what do you see through the IP address? Can you provide the IP address? What, is it, what do you have? I can check it from Mossad also. Uh, no, I actually just prefer to show it to you. Can you send me the request to do screen share? Mm. You have my IP address? Yeah. Which place is, is, is it showing to you? Oh, look at that. New Delhi. Like I, was, like I said. You're, you're sitting in your totally right now. That's, that's a, that's a, this time is a lot of bullshit. <laughs> okay, you want, you want me to read totally, it to you? You want me to read it to you? One, yeah, read it one, one, five, dot one, one, two, dot one, five, nine, uh -huh. dot two, five, zero. You think I'm screwing no. around? No, that's not my IP address. Yes, it I is. I cannot tell you. One, one, five, not, dot one, I'm, one, one, I'm, I'm two, not, dot uh, one, on. five, nine, I dot two, five, zero. You're sitting in, no, that's not my, uh, let's see, country, uh -huh. India, capital, New Delhi, state, New Delhi, city location, New Delhi, ISP is Tata Communications, uh, Asia, Kolkata, time zone. Tata Communications is pretty popular, actually, uh. You were stupid enough to click on that Blaze link, and I got your IP. I only gave that Blaze link to you, so that means that you were the only person that clicked on that link. I have your IP address. No, no. Here, here, here. Uh, send the request to s show my, uh, see my screen again. You don't want you, you <laughs> Oh, he hung up. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> All of a sudden, he's not uh, so tough. Well, let me find. Uh... Oh, that was such a good number. Tells me the. I'll actually have the phone system set up right now, so I'm just using Google Voice directly.
We are sorry, no one is currently available to take your call. Leave your message at the tone. Press pound when finished. We are sorry, no one is currently available to take your call. Leave your message at the tone. Press pound when finished. Ah, uh, you guys don't answer your phone. That's too bad. I was having fun. Technicians experiencing issues now. <laughs> they probably have plugged their internet. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Transferring the call to my supervisor here. To my supervisor here. 